Okay guys, this is another unboxing from my return from my trip to Dayton. And what we have is another toy. It's a power meter for VHF UHF that is good for 200 watts, I believe, because on the box, what you have here, you can see, you have the model. And I have the 893, which is VHF UHF. It's good for 200 watts. It has three different steps, so that's very good. So you want to test an HD or whatever, so you can with this meter. But what I like the most is the light display that they add there at the invention, which is some sort of a white, cool white, and I like it very much. It is large, it is very large. And in the beginning, I was looking at the small meter that are more portable, they're good you know, to carry around to test your two meter antenna on your mobile. But the problem with those, if you want it in the shack, is that my coax are heavier than this thing. So, and another thing, it's pretty small and you will see two big coax behind of it. And I wanted something that I can stay connected on my TS-2000 or my ID-5100. Because in the shack, I want to monitor. I used to have some bird meter that I use with my, in my rack there. Uh, that I use with my um, with my uh, repeater but this is you know takes a lot of place it is pretty expensive as well this one I think it's 129 or something like that or 109 USD and you know it's very neat cool it's not too big and it is big enough to be used in the shack permanently and if you want to test your mobile antenna you can just unplug it and bring it in the car as well I have a lighted display. When I relax in my room and doing radio, I always enjoy when I can turn on all the lights and when I turn the lights, so then I can, uh, I can uh, then relax and smooth out. But I want to see my meter as well. So having a light in it is very important for me in the shack. So this is the meter. Let's do the unboxing of that one. So, hold on, I'm gonna turn it off. Turn, turn, it, turn, it, <laughs> turn it around. There you go. So, on top of the box, you have the manual for the meter. Pretty simple. Cross needle, no need to align anything. It's just straight in, and that's it. Okay. And this will be similar for all the other models that are doing uh, HF, VHF, and different band. So, but the model will be similar. There you go. Very well packed. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. Look at my end and look at the. Look at my end. Look at the meter size. It's almost a look. This is what I like. Okay, gotta be very careful with those meter. Don't drop it because everything that has, you know, a precise instrument in it with needle like this, anything. Okay, don't drop it. <laughs> so let's open that up. There's also oh, they included the power for the light. That's great. I'll put some. And it's in power pole later on on it and we'll do a complete review of it so i'll will do the testing of that meter and uh, i'm very happy when i find those and the price that i paid for the, what the price as it sells for sorry and this is this is very neat this is very neat look at this very well packed look like a present there you go. Let's open that up. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Very nice. It's heavy enough to not move with the cable in the back, even if it's a, the larger one, the 581. I have it's a RG, uh, RG213. That's what I use. There, take a look at this. Very nice. Stay tuned as I will review this unit, look in the back, look at nice. Can see I'm out of focus. There you go. There you go. So you see it. This is the nice power meter. Hold on a second. Very, very nice power meter. I'm pretty sure you agree. Very happy with this. Very nice front step here. Good, very, very good. Feel quality, very feel, feel very nice. Actually, 
very I'm surprised I'm surprised that you know quality feel I, it wasn't a display on the MFJ boot but uh, I didn't take it in my hand nice as they were all piled up stay tuned for the review 73